Welcome back. The weekend has come to an end. We're starting a new work week and it is cooler than it was last week. Still a little bit muggy, but look at the temperature. 71 degrees. Things are looking much better for the time being. Wind out of the north at 10 miles per hour. Thankfully, not as muggy as it was over the weekend, but we are cooler. You know, it's rugby already down into the 60s as it's hour 64 in Rolla, but the rest of us are in the 70s. Can do also at 68 degrees. That wind remains light out of the north and it's going to stay that way for the moment, but as we go throughout the rest of the week, uh, we will start to feel the wind picking up as we go into at least by Wednesday and beyond severe thunderstorm watches mostly in South Dakota into Iowa and Minnesota. Thankfully, all of that severe weather will remain well to the south of the Minot area, but we will have chances for some light showers later on tonight and early tomorrow morning. But for now, just a few spy showers far southern parts of Montreal County pushing closer to the Missouri. But for now, looking dry across north central North Dakota. But late tonight and early tomorrow morning, we will have the potential for a few scattered showers as we go into our morning commute. After that, uh, we will have clouds throughout at least the first half of the day that pushes out and we start to see more sunshine as we go into the afternoon and that's going to allow temperatures to at least rise into the mid 70s for tomorrow afternoon. But rain chances for tomorrow mainly in the morning dry afterwards, but we do have more chances for showers, maybe even a couple of thunderstorms late into Wednesday and early Thursday morning. A couple of isolated severe storms cannot be ruled out, but that greater chance of severe storms for the second half of Wednesday is going to remain long as south of the interstate for now. If that changes, I'll let you know, but as far as our precipitation, not expecting a lot of accumulation, nothing to be too concerned about. You'll notice Temperatures kind of fluctuating up and down over the next several days. As we go into Sunday, we're once again back in the 70s. Afterwards, we get a warming trend for next week, and that's where we'll be back into the 80s with typical summer-like weather after Labor Day. But for tonight and tomorrow morning, rain chances roughly 20 to 30 percent with lows in the 50s. Then we're only going to be in the low to mid 70s again tomorrow. Notice the wind not that bad, mostly out of the southeast for tomorrow overall around 5 to 15 miles per hour. But the wind is going to be picking up for Wednesday. Could be breezy at times. The strongest wind likely for Thursday could have some gusts around 30 to 35 miles per hour continuing through Friday. So a little bit of a cool down underway. Temperatures going up and down. We'll have a day or two of 70s, a day or two of 80s, and it's kind of going back and forth. But the main story is that for your Labor Day weekend across North Dakota, looking to be calm overall with 70s and 80s for highs, lows mainly in the 50s, Joe. All right, thank you so much for that, Henry. Well